Hello everyone, in today's video I will show you how you can install uh, Bluestack and how to use the multi instance uh, manager. For those who do not know what is uh, Bluestack, this is an Android emulator that allows you to play Android games in your Windows devices. Very useful when it comes to Asphalt 8 as it will allow you to watch ads that you have no access on your PC or laptop. To start, let's go to the Bluestack website. And we are going to download the Bluestack 10 as that is the latest version of this app. We're going to save it on our desktop. Then we're going to install it. In this case, I'm not going to install it as I already have the app installed. You go ahead and install it. Once your app is installed, go to your app list and click on Bluestack X. After your app is launched, you will go to the app player. It is on the little corner here on the left hand side of the screen. It's like a little stack of books. Click on that one and that will launch the app player. After our app is loaded, we will go to systems and apps then to the Play Store. Here we will go for our game. Once you find your game, you choose and install your game, but in my case it's Asphalt 8, as that is the only app that I'm running in the Blue Stack. Once you install your app, and your app is ready to go, we will go to the little dots here. It's like a little square inside another square. This is a multi-instance manager. You launch this app. Once uh, you have launched your multi-instance and you have installed your game, when you open uh, the game on emulator, uh, sometimes you can have very very strange uh, color or decoloration on the game this is how you can fix it just wait for the app to for the app, app player to start click on the on the game and like you like I said you can see the color is really strange how this is how you can fix it called uh, to your settings sounds and display and move the little quality to what it says fastest performance let's start your game and now your game should look better you have all the apps that you will see, it, all the icons that you will see on the phone. You have them on your PC. You have the option to watch all your ads. Something that is uh, very important is that you do not watch the ads until you have cloned your device. If you watch the ad first, once you clone it, you will not have any ads because you already watched it. So you're just cloning the same uh, device. To close, uh, To clone your instance, you will click here. But is the one square inside of the square it says a clone instance it, this is depending on how much memory you have you can make as many clones as you need you you clone your device try to choose the lowest spec for the device that you're cloning uh, this will allow you to make more uh, multiple instances 
the more memory you have, the more instances that you can create. You have finished uh, creating the instance. The game should be operating just the same if already installed. So you don't need to wait as soon as a new instance is created. Just a click on your instance, start now. And wait for you a player to start. Start your game. There you go. Same game, same ads. Everything is the same. You can just ready to play. I normally just uh, use uh, these two as uh, the ads to get the credit, uh, the fusion coins, and the ads with the tokens. Now, because we got the cake home, I'm also watching the ads for the cake on here. So that helps you to get more cakes and give you more chances to win the prizes. Right, guys, I hope you have learned something new today. I hope this is useful for you as well. Uh, thank you so much for watching. See you next time.